Greetings YouTube, welcome back to the channel. I said I would commentate these in batches of 50. I got to 50 and said, okay, here's round number two. And I'm just now getting to Twitter submissions, email submissions. So I'm going to have at least three, if not four, episodes of this series. It takes me about three hours to do each one, given how much time I have to spend behind the scenes answering things. And you know, three hours of work, the video usually makes about five bucks. <laughs> Which, $5 is $5. I'm never going to turn my head at that. But, you know, it's like $1.50 an hour worth of uh, time. So, these are a labor of love for people to get their name in a YouTube video. And so, I just ask for you to be patient and understanding. Sometimes people hit me up and they're impatient that I haven't responded. Or they don't like the kind of response I give them. And it just makes me want to stop doing these series. Thankfully, the majority of you are just appreciative to have me put your name in and your submission in. We've got some good, some bad, and some ugly once again. L Chingo N gives us Black Widow Clairvoyant in this class-based nexus. And then also got me. That's right, Mr. Negative. Shout out Pixie Bell. In the non-class-based regular nexus. Hawaiian Maniac, what a name that is, huh? Sunspot. DK Cody 42. Look at this. Shang-Chi. Versus Awakening Captain Marvel movie. What a first world problem that is. How about Kill a Kai with a Awakening of Captain America Infinity War. I am jealous of that. HHRYU. longtime supporter of the channel. X23, I guess. Interesting Nexus. And then how about this? He already had Omega Red Awaken and Max Sig. So he either had to Awaken Domino or White Max. That's still a really good... Mutant Nexus, and then he got Hit Monkey instead of Awakening Warlock. Two really good Nexus between these two. Fun Guy Chris. Corvus versus Mr. Negative. Gotta go with Corvus, right? I don't think Chris has ever submitted anything to the channel, so congrats. 8 Bit Champ. That's a cool name, right? Sorry, Alcoholic and Dragon Man's Awakened ability, but Black Widow Clairvoyance gotta come through in the clutch. Fox Tastic. Human Torch. Neopotam, Awakened of Domino, also uh, Awakened Colossus, and a third six-star sighting, this time from a Cavalier Nexus Crystal in Elsa Bloodstone. Already had her, but still amazing. And then a second six-star with Mole Man himself being Awakened. How about Black Knight? Not to be confused with Batman. Silver Centurion, maybe? He didn't get Ghost, but still, all tech from the tech. Crystal, Black Knight, also in this, got Spider-Ham, I guess? That's a good debate between Spider-Ham and Immortal Hulk. Both great champions. Tiger 3-1, Ghost Rider Awaken versus Human Torch or War Machine. I think you gotta go Human Torch, but a fantastic Nexus all the way around. Zimmer got Crossbones because he already had Max Sig Doctor Doom. Wow, Zimmer. Everybody feels so bad for you. And then also already had Sunspot Awakened, so I guess you got to go Havoc over Caban Mike's Lover Cyclops. Guru Jose, Dr. Doom sighting in the house with a Mystic Nexus. Bustero, Sunspot in the house. Also Awakened is Namor versus Red Mags. What a choice that is. I think you got to go Red Mags though and just hope to get a Awakening Gym on, on say Cyber Weekend. Dark Rawl 2. What up, Void? Dark Rawl 2 also awakened his Angela from the regular Nexus. KZA5. I cannot tell you how many submissions we've had this weekend that had Shang-Chi. So many lucky summoners. This time again against Captain Marvel movie. Gotta go with Shang-Chi. Samuel. How about this? I had to include this. 10 of the Nexus calves. Three six stars, including Wasp, Hulkbuster, and Gwenpool. Also a five star Nexus, not bad. Woogie Boogie! Woogie Boogie! Doctor Doom, Sig 200, gotta love it. Chase, Immortal Abomination. Love that for Chase. Very jealous. I want a six star Immortal Abomination so far. In fact, uh, so bad, I should say. In fact, since I now have Omega Red Awakened. I'm thinking about either going for the skill Nexus from now on, next month for Cyber Weekend for Nick Fury, or 
Really, science, I can awaken my Red Hulk. I can get a Mortal Abomination. I can awaken the Dad Bod. Science might be the best choice overall. Though I'm probably going to get, you know, trash. What's up, Ghost? For Becky Man. Also, thank God. Because before the alcoholic showed up, you'd want to drink yourself. Silly, with Loki and Juggernaut as your first two options. Spazad. Spazad? Spazad? I probably just butchered his name three different ways. Corvus in the house. Also, Dollar General Batman versus Apocalypse and An Awakening of Colossus. This is an incredible uh, mutant nexus for Team Weapon X, which Weapon X is quite ironic. How about Ruroni? Longtime supporter of the channel. He ends up in a lot of these videos. Captain Marvel movie. And also either An Awakening of Apocalypse or An Awakening of Red Mags or Sunspot. This is a thumbnail nominee, though I don't think I've got an idea of who it is in mind. This is like number two, so you just missed the thumbnail. Congratulations on that. Kojo Dai, Awaken Shang-Chi, Awaken Tigra, or Red Mags. This is another probably top five thumbnail nominee. Light Darkness, another Shang-Chi sighting or Awakening Cable or Civil Warrior. Gotta go with Shang-Chi. And then PSP 742. This would go in the ugly category. Pretty much either Awaken, Electra, or Juggernaut. Axe Grinder 12167. Speaking of ugly, you're going to be hard pressed to find a more hide the bleach Nexus crystal submission than Iron Fist, Psylocke, or Iron Man. At least they're new champions. And Psylocke out of the three is the one I choose because you can make her a horsewoman and make her better. But that is just throw up status. Cutlass awakening his six star moment. Also, a brand new Doctor Doom in the Mystic Nexus Crystal. Trojan Eagle 1000. Uh, Mephisto over Juggernaut and Electra. And how about this? Awakening a Sorcerer Supreme or Sasquatch? Nope. Doctor Doom for Trojan Eagle. De Ragin. De Ragin Cajun. Da Ragin Cajun. I think I said that right. Human Torch. Busting in, busting out. Shadow Dread, six star Shang Chi in the house. Also awakened his Doctor Doom. And then we have, you can't see this. If you uh, hide my webcam, you can. So let's hide the webcam real quick so you can see the name Djax. And the next one is Djax. So he got Hit Monkey or Awaken Warlock. Gotta go with Hit Monkey, right? I love Hit Monkey. And then Cosmic Ghost Rider as well bring myself back and then buck jam 22 dr doom versus domino versus karnak <sighs> gotta go dr doom and then also this is what i had in mind for the thumbnail dr doom and black widow clairvoyant back to back top two by far mystic prizes and then juggernaut you can just cover with an emoji which i'll probably do so that is the top thumbnail for buck jam 22 and that takes us to the end of the 50 submissions for episode number two. I am so happy to do this. Just remember to be patient as it takes up a lot of time and is a labor of love as most of these videos are. You know, but, but it's not about clicks. It's, it's about community. Uh, I say that knowing I have a real full-time job as a college professor and so I can do a lot of these videos just for fun. But that's why I really do appreciate when you watch every second of my videos, when you subscribe, when you hit that like button, all that usual stuff because it does make doing all of this worth it and just hopefully making uh, people's day better by seeing their name in this is uh, is a goal of mine that you know money can't really put into words it's more of just pride because I can't take the money with me but I can hopefully take the pride with me as uh, maybe existential as that sounds as a ending to a video episode two is done episode three will probably be tomorrow Congrats to everybody who made it into episode two.